Sports with Jake Duran. We tipped off the state tournament in girls high school basketball with quarterfinal play. We're going to start in Division 3. Calumet traveled to Houghton Lake to take on Maple Slady Glen Lake. This game was played at a breakneck pace in the first half. The Copper Kings' Marybeth Hallinan going to drive and dish to Alexis Strom for the transition bucket. Glen Lake, they can run the floor as well. Jessica Robbins with the block. And Grace Bradford going to grab the loose ball and find Haley Helling running the floor. She'll lay it up and in. Lakers up two at the half. Glen Lake starts off the third on fire. Bradford going to fight through the double team. She'll bank it home the off-balance shot. Lakers up 12. Calumet erases that lead. Lizzie Tarola is going to score the basket and the foul. Copper Kings come back to tie the game up at 52. Calumet going to carry that momentum into the fourth. Hallinan connects from three from the wing. Copper Kings advance, defeating Glen Lake 73-69. Escanaba played against Portland in the Division II quarterfinal. Eskimos get on the board thanks to this three ball by Maddie Munkovich. A bit later, Cole Kameen driving baseline with a step back. Escanaba down 6-5. Moe's now down by 11. Mari Bink at the top of the key. She's trying to get the Moe's back into it with that transition three. Second quarter, Kameen slashing to the rim for the score. Eski's season, however, going to come to a close night, falling 47-41. Let's go to the Division IV quarterfinal between Carney Nato and Rudyard at Lakeview Gymno Gymnasium in Nagani. With Rudyard up a basket, Taylor Kedish going to drain a triple to give the Wolves a one-point lead. Rudyard's Tristan Smith and going to drive down the center of the lane. She'll float one up and in. It's 11-7 Rudyard. Tessa Wagner was a huge problem down low for the Bulldogs. She dominated around the basket. She scores an easy one there. Second quarter, we're tied at 18. Chesney Molina gets the shot just up and over the basket for the score. Rudyard goes up 2018. Then Carney going to put a run together. Jay Linder going to finish with the left. And then it's Haley Ernest. She's going to drive and hit the runner. Carney Neto moves on to the state semis with a 62-52 win over Rudyard. The men's college basketball.